Today I'm going to show you how to test a flame sensor on a gas furnace using the Fluke 902 FC HVAC clamp meter. Set the meter to microamps. Locate your flame sensor inside your furnace. On this one it is located right here. This is our service switch or blower switch. This is going to kill the power to almost everything inside the unit. This is open right now. Grab the wire that is connected to the flame sensor and remove it. I have one alligator clip connected. I'm going to hook this to the flame sensor. My other test lead I'm going to put into the plug that was plugged in to the flame sensor. Just like that. I need a call for heat. So I'm going to connect the white wire and the power wire on the terminal. Next, I'm manually going to push in the blower switch to start the furnace. Inducer motor has come on, flame rod has come on. Should get flame here shortly. And we can see the microamps right now. And looks like we're maxing out at 1.6. Now just for funsies, we're going to go ahead and clean this flame sensor to see if we can get some more microamps out of it. And you can see there is some oxidation on this. So we're just going to take the steel wool and gently, gently clean it. Just like that. Looks nice and shiny. Go ahead and put this back in. Just held in by one screw. Most of them are like that. And we'll put our alligator clip back on and see if that helped any. And right off the bat, you can see we've got 2.5 microamps, which is significantly more than what we had. If you work on a lot of gas appliances, such as water heaters, furnaces, fireplaces, I would highly recommend investing in something that can then check the microamps, like this meter right here. It's going to take the guesswork out of the repair that you're making. And 95% of the time, this can be fixed just by cleaning the flame sensor like I did just there. Thank you so much for watching. My name's Dave. See you on the next one.